hello, good evening, great to see you, great to see you. Hello, how's it going? Good, good. Teacher. Hello, hello, Elena, great to see you. Uh, Edwin Arias. I uh, know, Chris, uh, Chris Cruz. I, I thought you had another name. It's me. Okay, cool, that is you. Jose, Daniel, hello, how's it going? Nice, good, excellent, fine, good, great. Okay, welcome guys. Uh, yesterday we didn't, we, okay, great to see you. Yesterday we didn't have class because of the the day of the which uh, which holiday did we have yesterday which holiday did we have yesterday which was the holiday yesterday yesterday the date hmm? yesterday uh -huh. No, creo, no, no sé cómo se dice en inglés. <laughs> Iba a decir otra palabra, pero okay. es normal. Ok, ideas, ideas. No, don't worry if you are not sure. We are going to see. Day, de, days, day, no sé, no. Ok, close, close, close. The day of the dead. Kind of weird. Ah, ok. The day of the okay. dead. Ok. Or the day of the holy ones. That's another option that I would give it. Yo le daría esa otra opción. Okay, let's see. Uh, I'm sharing the monitor. Do you see it? Do you see the buffaloes on my background? Yes, I see. Yes, I see. I see it. It, only one. It is for one, singular. Um, and for plural, uh -huh. we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine buffaloes. Yes, I see. No ideas, no ideas. Okay, I'm going to show you in a moment. Yes, I see it is for singular. Do you see the screen, guys? Okay, but the answer, the answer, the answer, the answer. Do you see the screen? Yes, I see the screen. Yes, I see the screen. It. Oh, yes. Or, or yes, I see the screen. The screen and it are the same. But not to repeat the screen, para no repetir the screen, the screen, the screen. We can use okay. it. Okay, but do you see the buffaloes? Mm -hmm. Yes, I do. Yes, similar. Similar. Yes, yes I see. They, yes, I see them. Them, correct. Is them. Why is them? Porque es that? Plural. First is plural. Primero es plural. And then you use it instead of they. This is incorrect. Yeah. If you write it like that, si lo pone así, no, it's totally wrong. Está mal así. It's wrong. They is incorrect. So is them. them. Yes. Because this one goes at the end, but at the end. Okay, at the end. In that, in that case, it will be correct. Yes, I see them. See los, los. Los veo. Yes. Or in the case of the computer, see la. Veo. La veo. La y los. Singular, plural. Okay, clear, clear on that. Yes. Clear, clear. clear. Okay, good. All right. Let's see. Ah, I was, I was, uh, I was telling you, the day of the dead, right? The day of the dead, or another option can be the day of the holy, of the holy de, de los santos, 
the mm -hmm. de los santos difuntos correct yes the day of the holy then it's another option that you can use okay good all right guys uh let's see uh, did you finish the platform yes have you have you finished the platform the assignments the final test everything i finished did you get the diploma did you get sorry did you yes, get teacher i get i get it i got good evening teacher i got it. I got, I got it. it I got it i got it good evening hello good evening good evening uh, let's see jancy okay he's uh talking hey you got microphone today nice yo cool terminé pero pero la plataforma no aceptó yo inclusive vi en el chat de whatsapp algunas respuestas que yo mm -hmm. pienso que usted las compartió no aceptó de ninguna forma por ahí también me mandaron algo para reiniciar no para Didn't nada work. Sí, okay. sí, sí tengo el diploma, pero ahí quedaron algunas cosas porque no las aceptaba. Es decir, cuando yo le daba clic a enviar, uh -huh. nada, no pasaba nada y siempre me seguía diciendo error, error, error. Okay. No sé qué pasó. Yeah, it's a, maybe the platform, some, some students or some of your classmates who have completed that part and they didn't get the mistakes y no tuvieron error ellos verdad solo algunos entonces ya es de la plataforma hay que reportar eso para que people from the I, the technology or the administrative people can work on that yes. para que puedan trabajar en eso también ok siempre se, hay que reportarlo hey this section no it doesn't accept no acepta esta respuesta etc Okay, but that's cool that you received the diploma, right? Uh, Elena, Encelia, Jose, uh, Joanna, yes, did. I ah, know Joanna did. Okay, you did already too. Yes. Hello? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Okay, perfect. Okay, that's great. So, no issues at the end of the model. Okay, that's more than excellent. Okay, let's open. Uh, today we have the penultimate. What is penultimate? Similar in Penulti. Spanish. Correct. Similar. Penultima. Penultimate class. Imagine tomorrow is the final class and Merry <laughs> Christmas, by the way, <laughs> because we don't see each other on Christmas. And Merry Christmas and Happy New Year, and that's it. Okay, tomorrow is the final class. Okay, great that you are connected in this one too. Let's advance quickly. Okay. Uh, let's see. Okay, a new topic. It's kind of new. Do you know about this already and yet? Already and yet. Uh -huh. No ideas, no? I, uh... Ya y todavía. Ya o todavía. Ah, okay, you get an idea. Okay, perfect. Good. Uh, today. Today we are going, going to, learn to learn about, about how, to, how use to use just, just already, already and yet getting in various sentences, sentences regarding, regarding mm -hmm. the present perfect tense. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. This is uh this is a mini topic that we can use uh with with the present perfect with the present perfect that we have been practicing in two classes in two past classes already and yet okay in the sentence sentence example is i haven't seen, I that, movie seen that movie yet okay i haven't seen that movie yet what is the meaning of yet at the end todavía. of the sentence. Aún todavía. Aún no, todavía no. no. Uh -huh. Todavía. Okay, correct. Todavía, todavía no, etc. Okay, that is the meaning. Yet is at the, at the end. If you see, at the end of the sentence. Al final está. Okay, good. Let's see. 
uh, develop develop the next the exercise, next exercise. exercise. So practice about how to use ready and jet okay uh, we have just two i something that we have just we are gonna open the link uh let me see we are gonna open the first link the best way to understand something is uh, paying attention and practice let's see and do that veamos si hagamos eso Okay, ah, no, this is not the link. That is the link of the practice. Let me look for the correct link. Uh, ready and jet, maybe it's the second one. Mm, okay, this is practice two. Practice two. Uh, number three. Another practice. We can do that. Okay, throughout the class, do we have another link? No, we don't. We don't have. Ah, no, this is the, I didn't see it. No lo vi. Okay, but this is the link. Let me open it. Because the other links are practice to develop. Uh, this is the one. Just let me activate the link. And let's go there. First is this, the explanation and then the exercise. Okay. Aha, uh -huh. let's close some aids. Okay, just present, present, perfect. Present, and, perfect, and past perfect. Okay. okay, but mainly, principalmente, we are gonna study just already. Already, yet. And yet. Okay, oh, good. Great. Present, perfect. Simple. Simple. We use already, already and yet. And yet. Okay, you told me. Ah, yet means and this. Yet significa esto. But already? What is the meaning of already? Ideas? Similar yet. Ya. Ya. Ya, you said? Yep. Correct, yeah. Just, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, okay, correct. That is the meaning, yeah, done. In other words, is done, hecho, yeah, finished, done, finished, etc. That is the meaning of already, correct? And just, the meaning of just? Solamente. Solo. Uh, so, in this so, case, hello? no, because we're going to use it with the present perfect. In present perfect, just mm -hmm. means uh -huh. okay. Es como decir only. No. No, it's different. Just is different. A just is when you Solamente. have no, no, when you have no. finished something a moment ago. Es como decir recién. Recién. Ah, recién, correct, a moment ago. In other, in other words. Ok, ¿cómo digo acabo de terminar una clase? Just finished a yes. class. Uh, but the subject, finished. the subject. The subject. I, I just. Ay, 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 I ay, just finished a class. Okay, I, I, I just, I just, or, or that's it, no more. Like that, I see, I just. I have, I, ha, I have, I have just. just. Or the contraction, let's practice with the contraction. I, is I, the, I, 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 I just, just finish, 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 finish the finish. class. Another, another, let's say, the another class. Another class. class. Okay. Correct. I've. Mm -hmm. I've just, just, just finished another class. Another class. Another class. Okay, how do I say, me acabo de comer dos pastelitos? I've just. I just. Eight. 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 Uh, eight. 
Eaten. Okay. Ah, eaten. Just ah, eaten. Okay, remember, the participle eaten. in present perfect is the participle. Just eaten. Uh -huh. eaten. eaten. Two cake. Two, no, pastelitos. Uh, eh. No, pastelitos. The normal pastelitos, yes. Pastelitos. pastelitos. Uh, for the dinner. That was my dinner, <laughs> by the way. Two pastelitos were my dinner, but they were delicious. Okay, for my dinner. Okay, that's it. Okay, and this is the meaning of just. Yes, clear? Uh -huh. Clear. Okay, a moment ago. Hace un momento, ahorita, recién, etc. Good. All right. Uh, let's go back. Uh, okay, this is a video that we are going to check. Let's uh, pay attention to it. And we are going to check about the present perfect, how to use just already and yet and then we are going to read the the rest of the information about it okay attention only attention your attention present perfect with just yet and already I've just finished dinner. Hmm. Dad, I've already got the post. Have you tidied your room yet? No, I haven't done it yet. We use the present perfect with just, yet, and already to talk about recent news and events. We use just to talk about a very recent event. We use already to say something happened sooner than we expected. We use yet to talk about an event that has not happened, but we expect it to happen in the future. We use just in questions. Has Jim just got home? And positive sentences. Yes, he's just got home. Two minutes ago. We put just before the main verb. We use already in questions. Have you finished your homework already? and positive sentences. Yes, I've done it already. We put already at the end of the sentence or question or before the main verb. Have you already finished your homework? Yes, I've already done it. We only use yet in questions Have you eaten lunch yet? and negative sentences. No, we haven't eaten lunch yet. Yet appears at the end of the sentence. All right. Was the explanation clear or would you like to see it a second time? Second time, yes? Or yes, clear? Second time. Yes. Second time. Second time. Okay. Yeah, because because of the position uh, at the end, in the middle. Okay, we, we can check. We can double check. Present perfect with just, yet, and already.
I've just finished dinner. Hmm. Dad, I've already got the post. Have you tidied your room yet? No, I haven't done it yet. We use the present perfect with just, yet and already to talk about recent news and events. We use just to talk about a very recent event. We use already to say something happened sooner than we expected. We use yet to talk about an event that has not happened, but we expect it to happen in the future. We use just in questions. Has Jim just got home? And positive sentences. Yes, he's just got home. Two minutes ago. We put just before the main verb. We use already in questions. Have you finished your homework already? And positive sentences. Yes, I've done it already. We put already at the end of the sentence or question or before the main verb. Have you already finished your homework? Yes, I've already done it. We only use yet in questions. Have you eaten lunch yet? And negative sentences. No, we haven't eaten lunch yet. Yet appears at the end of the sentence. Okay, we can check more than this in to see how it works. The first sentence says, I've already, I've, I've already, already visited, visited three, universities. three universities. Three universities. Uh, oh, you mean universities, it's plural, okay. If you check, here is telling you, okay, already, where is the location of already, where is it? Before the, the main verb. Before the main verb, and the main verb is? Visited. Visited, visited, correct. Second sentence. She's just, just won the match. The match. Okay, she's just won the match. Uh, what is the meaning of this? The meaning? Mm -hmm. The meaning or the translation, in other words. What is the meaning? She's just, she's just won the match. Remember, just, oops, when I click on that, it activates it. Mm -hmm. uh, remember, just, the meaning, what is the meaning of just? Ella acaba de ganar. Oh, acaba de ganar el, the match. Match is partido. O oh, el encuentro. Okay, next, next sentence. I haven't made a decision yet. Yet. All right. If you see yet, 
is at the end of the sentence. It's affirmative, it's negative, but yet it's at the end. And this one, a question, have you? Have you seen that new thing yet? Yes. Yes, I have. Or? No, I haven't. Or no, I haven't. Uh, it says we can use the present perfect positive with just or already. It says positive with just and already. Subject, the formula, this basically is the formula. Subject plus have, have, or um, has or has depending or has, on the subject plus plus just already already plus, plus participle. the participle and the complement at the end and here is the the table in affirmative affirmative i can you read it i have i have already Visited three universities. Universities. Or you can use with just saying. She has. Mm -hmm. She has just won the match. The match. Okay. If you check carefully, just and already are in the same place. Están en el, en el mismo lugar. Okay. Oh, the power went out. Oh, no problem. Okay. All right. See, this is for affirmative with already before the main verb and just before the main verb too. Clear? Clear, clear. Clear. All right. Clear. We usually. Short forms. We usually I've... use. Mm -hmm. We usually use short forms. I. Mm -hmm. You. You. And his. his. And his. Etc. When we are speaking in. An informal writing. Writing. Right. Okay, good. We can use the present perfect negative with. Yes. Yeah. Okay, remember yeah. already and just are for affirmative sentences. And yet is for negative. Negative. Okay, and the formula, subject. Subject plus subject plus having plus plus participle plus yet. Plus yet, yet at the end. Examples, I. I haven't made haven't a decision made yet. yet. Yes. I haven't made, no he hecho una decisión. Aún. Todavía. Todavía. Aún todavía. todavía. Both, las dos. Uh, she? She, she has hasn't, finished. She hasn't finished. 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 Yet. yet. Okay. She hasn't finished it yet. Okay, finished it. Here we have a link in, a link in sound. Finish it. Uh, finished, it. finished it, finished it, finished like that. Finished finish it. it because the verb is finished with t, and this finished, finished it, it. Finished like it. that. The height sounds like finished, finished, finished it, finished it, like that. Something similar. That's a linking sound. Those sonidos juntos ahí. All right. Uh, we can form the present perfect questions with? Yet. Okay, yet. Re remember. Uh, yet is for negative and? Question. In questions. Okay. Here it, we only change. Solo cambiamos. Have? Has. Has. Plus subject. Plus subject. subject plus past participle plus yet. In yet. All right, in the sentences or questions in this case. Have you seen that film yet? Uh -huh. Have you seen that film yet? Or has, has he made, made a decision, decision yet? yet? Okay, in the third person, remember has, has for the third person. Has. Okay, we 
we form short answers with short answers. Yes, yes. Plus yes. subject yes. plus yes. have had. Yes. Okay, that's for affirmative. And for negative? No, no. Plus subject, subject plus haven't, yeah. hasn't. Or hasn't. All right. Uh, and it says, Regular verbs have past participles which are the same as their past simple forms, ending ed. Okay, uh, if you remember, I told you some classes ago that the participle of the regular verbs is the same past in the simple past. The visit. 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 Okay, simple past in the participle don't change, no cambio. Arrive. Arrive. Arrived. Arrived. Arrived uh, with D. Right. Arrived. Next day, uh, it says irregular verbs have irregular past participle. Sometimes the past participle of an irregular verb is the same as the past simple form, and sometimes it is different. For example, uh, have. For example, have, had, have, the had, participle. Lose, 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 lost, 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 lost. That is the same part. See? Same in the past, the same in the participle. In the case of did, do, do did, it, participle, done, 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 present, it, past, it, 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 correct, participle. Okay, okay, let's see. In British English, we use the present perfect, blah, blah, blah. Okay, okay, that's more information, and we finish in this part. Okay, but what else What else do we have besides the explanation? We have these three links. The three links. Richard. Yes, yes, yes. One question. Question. In, uh, in, uh, well, lastimosamente, cuando se está explicando lo del video, Se, se fue la luz por acá, oh. pero me quedó, una, me, me quedó una duda con una frase que tengo entendido que significa hijo, pero eh, ahí en, la, en el video aparece como sonar. Uh, okay. Sooner. Sooner, ajá. Sooner, this one. Sí. Exactamente. Ok, what is sooner, guys? Ideas. Ok, no idea. soon. What is soon? Próximo, próximamente. Próximo, oh, pronto, pronto. Pronto. Ok, and sooner is the comparative. Ok. Sooner. Más próximo. Correct. Más, más próximo. próximo. O oh, más okay. pronto. The same, o más pronto. El que está más próximo. Ok, sooner, the, the sooner. Próximo o más pronto. And that is the meaning, Edson. Ah, okay. That's the meaning. Thank yes, you. it's a comparative. It's a comparative. Okay, okay. soon, sooner. Okay. All right. Okay. Good, good. Clear. Okay, clear. All right. Thank you, teacher. No problem. Thanks for asking. Great question. Mm, okay, I was uh, telling you that we have uh, these exercises. This is grammar. And this is uh, like a mini game. Let's open it and let's see. This is to practice the same topic about present perfect. Uh, the indication is to rearrange or reorganize the sentence. Okay, you tell me what the correct order is. Check I this. haven't. I haven't uh, heard visit yet. I haven't uh, heard. Ah, oh, it's not letting me. I haven't visited her yet. Her yet. Oh, like that. Okay, let's see. Correct. At the end. Negative. Negative sentence. Next. Okay, 
how do I organize the words to make a sentence? It can be affirmative question. She has. She has. She has. She has. She has. She has. Has finished. 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 Already. She has finished. Already. She has read. Read the book. Your. Your. Okay. Only she has is correct because the other she words has are. She has read. Okay. Read. Yes. Read. Okay. Right. Mm. You have your red book. Ah. Your, so okay. Uh, she has to read. Ah, okay. See? Ready. Before, already yes. before right. the main verb. Yes or no? Before the main verb. Yes. Yes. Your. She has. Okay, read or or finished. What is the main verb? Finish. 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 Ah, okay. Real. Because, ah, finished. Well, because finished is Ready. the main verb. In that case, is not read because finished is the main verb. So the second verb is read. Read. Not read. Uh -huh. Read. Read. To to read your book. To read your book. To read your, your, book. your book. book. All right. There it is. It's completed and ordered. Next. Have they? They have. I, I, they I, 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 oh, they, we have the question mark. The question yes. mark tells you yeah. that is a question. Have they come? They have. They have is affirmative. Have they come? Have they, have right. they come? Have they come, come back, they back to a school yet? To a school yet. yet. To a school yet? Yes. Ah, correct. Question, question, question. Okay, that one. Uh, we are gonna do only uh, five, only five have, because we need to. We have, have we have uh, already watched the movie. We? Uh, we have already watched we have. movie. This movie. Already oh, okay. watched this movie. Watch this movie. We have already watched. This morning. movie. Okay, correct. Okay, nice, nice, nice. Uh, and fi the final one, because we need to move to the other topic. Mm. You haven't. You, you haven't. 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 Uh -huh. Prepare. Prepare. Or food. The the or food. All the. All the. Food all the yet. food yet. All the food yet. All the yet food, no, right? No, no sense. Food yet. Oh. Food, food yet. yet. Okay, good. All right. Okay, you can continue practicing with this, uh, with this exercise and the other ones that you have. You have three, three links to practice already, uh, just and yet. Clear? Okay, yeah. if you check. If you check, si usted ve o revisa, if you practice, you get, ah, okay, you get more idea about the order of the, of the words according with the exercise. Okay, but you can do the rest of the exercises when you have some free time. But we are going to continue with the next part. The next part is about in this one, let's see. Develop, Develop the exercises. The next. To practice, practice about to practice how about to use present perfect use tense and simple present past tense. Okay, this is uh, um, like a mini exercise about the difference, about the difference between a present perfect and the simple, simple past tense. But first is this one. 
present perfect and simple past. Do you remember when I explained it? Yes, no. Do you remember anything about that explanation? Ah, present perfect is for this and simple past is for this different thing, no? No, remember? You don't, okay, no problem. What's the tense in the first, the first, in the first and in second, the first tense, and sentence. second sentence. sentence? Okay, what's going on in the picture? What do you notice? Kenota, what do you notice in the picture? In English, in English, of course. She, she, loves loves her kids. Kids. she has she has lost the keys. Okay, very her good. Key. Okay, one of you, uno de ustedes dijo, ah, she lost. She okay, but it was the opposite. Era lo opuesto. Eh, the I lost my keys. I've... I lost my key. Okay. Uh, what is that tense? What is that tense? Simple past, present simple, or simple present. What is the tense? Present perfect. Present perfect, because we have, I have lost. I... Okay, the contraction in the? Lost. The verb. Lost. The, the verb. verb in participle. The verb in participle, participle. yes. Yeah. And the complement, oh. correct? In this one? I lost, I lost my, my keys last, last night. night. Last night. Last night. Last night. It's not last night. No, it's the opposite. Last, last night. night. Okay. Last and the tense? Simple it's past. No simple past. See? The subject. Yes. The verb in Girl. the simple, simple past. past. Okay. And that is the thing. That is the thing. Okay, just let me check. Uh, where did I do the link? Where did I place it? Uh, okay, this one was. Esta era. Okay, another sentence in. What is the tense? I found a beautiful house. Present perfect. Present perfect too. I've found. Is found. A house. Okay. A found regular house. or irregular verb. Irregular. Ah, irregular. Okay. And the simple present of found is. Fine. Find. Correct. Is fine. All right. Here is another website that you can check. That you can read if we don't finish but we are gonna try. What's, what's the difference present perfect and simple past? In simple past. Present, present perfect, the simple, okay? The simple present perfect. That is for? Unfinished. Unfinished. Action, action. that started. That the past started and continue to the present. Okay, they started in a specific point in the past, but they continue in, in throughout the present, a lo largo del presente. E, example, I've, I've known I've known Julie for ten years. For ten years. I still know her. And I still know her. Know her. Okay. The example goes until here, hasta aquí llega. I've known Julie for 10 years. But that means, pero eso significa que I still know her. No. Her. Aún la? Todavía la conozco. Yeah, because the relationship continues. La relación ahí continúa. Okay. And in the past simple, Elena, Past simple. That is for? Finished actions. I need new Julie for them years, but then she moved away and we lost touch. Okay, nice. I knew Julie for 10 years. I knew. What is I knew? What's Conocí. I knew? Uh -huh. Conocí. Okay. Conocí. No more relationship. 
the relationship eh, or the friendship was done. La amistad, done, finished. I knew Julie for 10 years and that means, but then she moved, she moved away and we lost touch. touch. We lost touch. communication, we lost touch. All right. And that is the difference. Unfinished actions, present perfect, and past simple or simple past is for finished. Finished, finished action. Finished. T. Finished. Finished, finished actions. Tea. All right. Finished. Let's see a present perfect. Uh, a. a finished action in someone's life. When the, person when the person is still alive, a life, life experience. Or a life experience. Okay, do you remember the class about two classes ago? In matters or the experience is the most important. Not the details about the experience, only the experience. And this is uh, one example. My, my brother. My brother, brother has, has been, been to Mexico, Mexico three times. Three times. Three times. In which in which part of Mexico? Do you know in, in which part of Mexico? No. Uh -huh. Not okay. important. Depends. Depends on what. De qué depende? Depends on what. Uh, but do you have details about the places that my brother was? In Mexico, do you have those details? Uh -huh. Do you have them? Tiene los detalles? No? Yes? No. No. Yeah, no. no. You don't have them. That means that the no. details are not important. And that is present perfect. Only the experience. The experience about what? Being to Mexico. To Mexico. Mexico. That is Great that times. is the experience. Uh -huh. When we talk about experiences, we talk about present perfect. And what is the, the difference between this and this? Ah, uh, past simple, a finished, a finished action. Action in someone's life. Someone's life. When the person is dead. Is dead. Is dead. Okay, that is the comparison. I still like la comparación. My great grandmother went, went to Mexico three times. Three times. Okay. Or not necessary that is she's dead. Tampoco necessary que esté dead, right? Maybe she cannot travel again, and that's it. Maybe tal vez no pueda viajar más, and that's it. My great grandmother went to Mexico how many times? Three. Three times. Three. Three. Okay. And, and this one is not mentioning the places, but you know that is simple past because of the because of the when of, of the, the when, action, of the verb. The verb. No, the verb. Okay, oh. went. Went is the past Earth. of go. Mm -hmm. This is not simple past. This is present perfect. And present this is perfect. simple past. Uh -huh. Check the verb. Check the verb. The verb is going to give you the key in the, the auxiliary in the present perfect. Okay, uh, present perfect. I finished. I finished. Action with a result in the present. With a result in the present. I've, I've lost my keys. The, the result, result is that I can't get into my house now. Okay. This is the, the result of this, of this action. And what happens in I've the simple lost. past? Uh -huh. What happens in the simple past? A finished action, action with no result 
in the present. Okay, the opposite with no result. I lost my face yesterday. It was terrible. Now there is no result. Got new case yesterday. Okay, I lost my keys yesterday. It was terrible. Now there is no result. I got new keys yesterday. Okay. In this one, you expect to find them. En esta espera encontrarlas, ¿sí o no? Yes. Uh -huh. In this one, in this situation, I no, right? Keys. You lost them and you don't know where. Los perdió y no se sabe dónde. Okay, and what was the, the, the result? Got, Got new keys. Uh -huh. yes. Obtener nuevas. That was, that was the, let's see the result. Pero aquí dice no hay resultado. Okay. Um, uh, finally, it's present perfect with... With an unfinished time board. This week, this month, today. I've seen. I've seen John this John week. John this week. This week. Okay, this week. Is it a specific uh, about a day? When you say this week, is it a specific Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? A specific. Is it? No. no, it's not. No. It isn't a specific no. because this week, it says this week can be Monday or it can be Friday or Saturday, but there is no, uh, there is no specific point. Okay. This month, this month today. okay, is that a specific for you when you say this month? No. No, no. okay, no. neither, tampoco. For today, does it tell you at what time? Eight, seven, six, 10, no specific. No, right? No specific. Time. Okay. I've seen John this week. He visto a John esta? Semana. Semana. When? Which day? We don't know. No se sabe. Mm -hmm. Okay. And when you have this, cuando tiene esto, that means present perfect. What is the difference with the simple past? With the finished time work. Last week, last month, yesterday. Okay, last week, is it a specific? Uh, last week, is it a specific? Yes or no? Last mm. week. Okay, uh, it's divided. Yeah. Aquí sí está dividida. Pero ahí depende de su contexto de la conversación, right? Last week, ah, I saw my sister last week. I don't remember or if it was Tuesday or Wednesday, but it was last week, pero fue la semana pasada. Last month, month. or yesterday. yesterday. Okay, but here depends. Aquí sí, it depends, ¿verdad? Si quieres ser very, very, very specific. I saw my sister last week on Tuesday because I remember the date. And that is the difference with this one. All right? All right. Okay. Questions? Questions with the difference between present perfect and simple past? Is that clear how to use them or where or when? More important. Or where, when to use it? Questions? Okay. What did you do uh, last night? Question, what did you do last night at 7 p.m.? I'm being very specific with the question. What did you do? Hello, 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 nothing? I <laughs> did you do? I did, I did a dinner. Okay. Simple. I did, I did the dinner, I, did but the dinner. I cooked, it would be better. Uh, Sería mejor I cook. I cook. I cook. I uh -huh. did, I did cook. Mm, only cook, I did a... only, uh -huh. do you see, did? I did oh, cook. I cook. Oh. Uh -huh. 
Yeah, I it is simple past. Correct, simple past. All right. And guys, uh, you can check the, the exercises about that. Simple past versus present perfect. So you can practice with these links. You have three links. Let's review uh, the first one. Let's do a couple of tracks with this one. Okay, question one. Get ready, get ready. Okay. Mm -hmm. My. I hope my dog. Eight. The verb is eat in parentheses. Eight. Wait. My homework. Read, my read homework the, the complement. Oh. Homework. My homework two, two weeks. weeks. Two weeks ago. Okay. What ago. is the correct one? My dog ate. Eight. 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 Let's see. Seven. All right. It is eight. Because it says last week, that is, or two weeks, two weeks ago, I guess. Okay, that was correct. Very correct. Carmelita. Carmelita fly to New York and City last, last night. Last night. Okay, but the verb <laughs> is fly. But present perfect or simple past? Flew. I did. Letter flu, A. Letter A, flu. Flu is a simple past of fly. Let's see. Let's check. Correct. Okay, perfect, perfect, correct. Simple past. All right. And let's uh, see this one. Guys, only Joanna is answering. Okay, next. I. I never. My phone. Mm -hmm. I didn't. I did lost. I did. But I did. I did never. Mm. I, I have, did lost. I have never lost. Okay. I have never lost. I have lost. never. Oh, no time. The answer was. He didn't show it. No la mostró. Okay, let's see this. Any, any. Okay, skip. Hey, he didn't show it. No la mostró. But I guess it was that one. Creo que si era esa. My grandparents. Oh. So the verb is have. after they got married. My parents had normal. Had. Had. Let it be. B. Uh, okay, got this simple pass, got married. Let's see if it's a letter B. Correct. Okay, cool. That was it. Okay, and the last one. Let's see the last one. It is not a snow Okay, this means uh, that is negative. Letter A. But Letter C. Letter C. C. Yeah. Uh, hasn't, right? Because yes. haven't is for plural. Yes. Or, uh -huh. Let's see. Letter C. Person. Correct. Okay, good. Almost casi correct. Okay, no problem. Uh, guys, the links are there for you to practice. Don't forget, and the lesson is going to be uploaded in the Google Drive in this part, in, in your folder. Okay, I guess is this one. Model, yeah, this is the one. Here is going to be. You can download it and practice with the links. All right. It's already 10, 10 p.m. Thank you for joining to the class. See you tomorrow for the last class. Have a nice night and rest. Rest a lot. Have a great Thank night. Thank you, teacher. Good night.
Have a great night. Good night. Bye. Good, good night, teacher. Thank, thank, thank you. Good night, thank you. everyone. Thank you, teacher. My pleasure. Good My night. pleasure. See you. Good night. You. See you tomorrow. Bye bye. Thank you, teacher. Good night. Have a great night, too. Thanks. Thanks. Bye bye.